My Uncle Murray and Aunt Joan, great couple. Just recently retired, Uncle Murray was an OPP, big bear of a guy. He's six foot six, 280 pounds. Aunt Joan, she was a nurse, but five foot two, little we squirt of the thing. Both retired, four kids, whole bunch of grandchildren, and uh, you know, everything was going on fine, except they were spending more time with each other, and they started to get a little bit on each other's nerves, especially with Uncle Murray's ongoing flatulence. <laughs> long and loud. And Joel finally had enough and she said, you know, you can't be doing that anymore. She said, you just, that is rude. And Uncle Murray said, everybody does it. Everybody has a certain amount of gas they have to get rid of. I choose to get rid of mine that way. She said, well, it's wrong. You, you shouldn't have that much. He said, well, that's just the way I am. She said, she thought she put her medical background to work and she says, you know, if you keep this up, you could actually lose some of your insides. Uncle Murray said, you don't know what you're talking about. He said, that's impossible. It couldn't happen at all. Well, Christmas morning rolled around. Aunt Joan's down in the kitchen preparing the turkey. Uncle Murray's upstairs in the bedroom, blasting forth, <laughs> interrupted by the odd snore. So Aunt Joan, she was getting a little bit ticked at his behavior, and she's cleaning away in the turkey, and she reached into the cavity and pulled up the giblets. <laughs> and she went, I wonder. So she tiptoed upstairs, reached up to the bottom of the bed, lifted up the sheet, and tucked the giblets right underneath the sheets at the edge of his boxers. <laughs> and headed back downstairs. Well, she's working away in the kitchen, getting everything all ready, and he's upstairs snoring away. Well, there came this huge blast, and then a bigger one, it pretty well shook the picture frames. And then a scream. Well, Aunt Joan, she... Just thought that was the best thing ever. And after about three minutes, Uncle Murray appeared at the kitchen door. He goes, you were right. And she turned around and he is as white as a ghost. And she says, I was right about what? He says, you were right about losing some insides. It happened. She said, oh my heavens, are you okay? And he said, I think so. But by the grace of God, some Vaseline and these two fingers are going to really put back in. so much when it comes to, uh, to fiddle music, and so much drive and so much passion. So we're going to do a little bit of what we call a clump. Other people call it a medley. We're going to do a clump of French-Canadian tunes. Here we go. 